Love is the foundation of every relationship. The foundation of love lay in the early years of a child affects their ability to learn and also to determine when a child is able to grasp new information. Every child has a special ways to express, receive, or even perceive love. According to the well-known family and children expert Gary Chapman ever mentioned, there are five primary love languages for children indeed to all the people. Speaking and recognizing your child's love languages can help your child know you love him. And your child needs to know he or she being loved and cared in order to grow into a giving, loving and responsible adult. First, physical touch, hugging, cuddling, touching, all this will let some kids feel safe and sense of secure. Whenever children are feeling sad or very happy, you might see that some kids really love to be hugged. By this hug, the child feels love. And especially if a child making a mistake after your discipline, you call them back and giving them a hug, they will feel belonging and being accepted. So parents, do more physical touch. You will notice that not only the younger babies need to be hugged, older children or even your spouse love to be hugged or kissed by you. So by this physical touch will create more bonding. Let's practice. Practice make improvement. Second, words of affirmation. It's focused on positive speech, encouraging, motivating and also praising. Praising the child will know what she or he has been done right. So give them more positive words that to affirm their behavior and acknowledge the efforts they have made. For example, you can praise their efforts in being responsible, especially praising the behavior. Praising behavior can enhance the children's character so that the child will know what is right and what is not acceptable. So let's do more praising at home today. This is one of the best ways in building children's character of confidence and courage. Third, quality time. Spending quality time with your child, being present, engaging, and focus to your child when you have any interaction with him or her. It is about the experience of a child feeling pressure, feeling happy, feeling engaging when you are having time with him. Fourth, act of service, helping serving the child, but based on their age and development needs. For example, a three years old child learning to eat different variety of food. It is okay for adults to feed them for trying the new food. This action is important for encouraging and motivating the child for trying new things. But it is not healthy to feed a six years old child to finish his meal. They will become dependent and rely on us. Fifth, presents. Most of the children love presents. But do you know parents, the present can be as simple as your child's favorite fruits, food, juice, dessert, stickers, or toys. Yes, parents, we value the relationship with the children and also the good behavior they have demonstrated. But however, do not rewarding the child merely by the values of the present. So by now, parents, you have mastered the five love languages. And sometimes you just need to be creative and apply more than one love language in different events. So practice may improve, parents. If you like today's sharing, do remember to like and share our Facebook, subscribe to our YouTube channel. See you then!